Morning, everybody. It's uh, 834 on Monday the 17th, and this is your pre-opening comment. It's video number 1497. Asia and European markets are mixed to slightly lower this morning. Uh, ours, however, is up strongly. Uh, when I came down, the Dow was up 325, NASDAQ 145, and uh, the S&P 44. And right now, uh, NASDAQ is gone from that plus 144 to 177. The Dow is in about the same area, up 347. And uh, the S&P is up about uh, 48. Um, Splunk, starboard, starboard activist taking a position in Splunk. SPLK, the stock is 77.55. That's up 7.32 or 10.4 percent. Starbird says that they're there to make the stock higher. Um, Trevor Milton from Nicola, uh, convicted of securities fraud. If you recall, that stock was uh, much higher. Let me just check and see what the uh, high was because it's pretty impressive uh, from the standpoint of what the stock has uh, done since they rolled that truck down the hill without an engine. Uh, the stock was as high as 94, currently selling at $3.08. I don't even want to bother with what the percentage loss there is. Uh, BP is buying Archesa Energy at $26 a share. The stock is $25.76, up $8.88, or 53%. Uh, this is BP's uh, first entree into acquisitions for cleaner energy technology. Uh, Bank of America, slight beat on lowered expectations. You know how I feel about that. Stock is only up 90 cents at 3260, 2.5%. Um, Morgan Stanley, this is a strange one because it's not properly worded. Morgan Stanley says AAPL, Apple, their top pick for a downturn. So does that mean that it's their top pick if there's a downturn or it's a top pick for a downturn. Kind of mixed up. Empire Manufacturing Survey down 9.1. Expectation was for down 5. Uh, so a uh, pretty big miss there. And Fox News and uh, News Corp looking like they may get put together. Uh, this is uh, uh, based on over the weekend news, uh, but you know, this is uh, Rupert Murdoch's companies, and he said he'd never combine them again, and yet here we are. Fox does not like it. Fox shareholders do not like it. The stock is 29.60, down 195 or six and a quarter percent, while News Corp is 16.44, up 40, 84 cents or 5.4 percent. Uh, Bostic. Friday afternoon. Big news. You know, these Fed governors care about nothing but what they want. Bostic uh, violated the uh, trading ban there for five years and had never announced it. Uh, while the stock is, um, I mean, while his positions are in, you know, uh, trust and he doesn't make decisions for it, it still looks pretty ugly. Uh, oil is up 17 cents. It was down about 50 cents. Uh, that gas is down 43 at 601. That's an area of strong support. We'll have to see if it holds. Uh, heating oil up a nickel. Gasoline slightly higher. Gold up 21, trading right near its highs. Uh, silver up almost 60 cents also near its highs and copper which i kind of really like here just made a higher low to test uh, the current bottom uh, it's up about uh un just under three cents kind of slow moving but once it goes it trends you know for quite a while 
Uh, in the softs, we have cotton up 58 cents, uh, coffee after an ex over 20% decline uh, last week, up $2, sugar a little higher, cocoa a little lower, lumber not open yet. Uh, as I said, the uh, tech, the indexes are higher. The dollar is lower. Bitcoin up 350. Ethereum up 20, and bonds down almost a point. All right, everyone, be careful out there. I'll be back later on today.